a cyber picker. R Ramo, I think is your name, something like that. Donna's here. Pam Clift is here. Will join us. Join us. Tammy's here. Guys, I've got to get rid of jewelry. So tonight, every time you make a purchase, I am drawing you a free gift out of that bag. That jar that I had um, when we were playing games. I'm going to draw you something out of it free every time you make a purchase. And that way I can move some of this quicker. Rommel. That's right. Rommel. Yeah. We're, we're me and Rommel. We talk almost daily and I don't even know. This is a new friend. Well, hello. I'm sorry. I've been dealing with some stuff, so I haven't got to touch any watches. Nothing. Yeah, I've showed him a few, but I'm still, I just show him a few at a time and then he decides which ones he wants me to put aside for him and then we'll go from there. But I still have more to show him. That's understandable. <laughs> <laughs> it is, isn't it? <laughs> All right, so uh, she says we have five here. We have enough for a sale to begin. And what we're going to do is we're going to sell jewelry tonight. Tomorrow at noon Eastern, we're going to be selling everything under the sun. And um, then with Jane on, at noon on Friday, uh, unless somebody's sick, we'll be there too, selling everything under the sun. So tonight, let's just indulge in some, in some beautiful jewelry at great prices. You're not going to find these prices on anybody else's channel. Uh, you're just not. That's just the truth. I speak the truth. So, uh, you know, take advantage of it while you can. If you're a reseller, you there's meat on the bones. Let's just put it that way. If you're not, just just make your jewelry huge. And that way you can pick what you want to wear, whatever matches what. And you can never have too much jewelry. Go buy you a bigger jewelry box. Uh, give it away as gifts. Christmas is just around the corner. That's what I've been buying for. You can't be there tomorrow at noon. Have a work meeting from 8 to 2. That's okay. You can re-watch. And if there's anything on there that um, didn't get bought up and you want it, all you have to do is just comment below the video. And it, it messages us that someone commented. And we'll get right back to you immediately. Uh, I answered those comments right away. Yeah, it's it's not a, it's not an easy task at all. But we um, we're trying for you, Rommel. We we want we don't want the damn things anyway. So there you go. <laughs> um, and well, let's see. I ship from Georgia. She ships from Ohio. We use pirate ship. We ship as cheaply as we can, even though. It seems like it's expensive sometimes. It seems that way to us, too, when we have to pay eBay or PayPal fees. And plus, every time we put that money in our bank account, they charge us another fee. So if we're selling you a $3 item, we probably get about $2 of it. A dollar of it is for PayPal fees and transferring our money over. So it's hard for us to sell a dollar item. It's just not really... You know, that's why we try to bundle things. Hey, book. Welcome in. Thank you for coming. Stay all evening if you can. We love it. We're hoping to be here probably till about 10 o'clock after that, if we make it till then. But after that, I'm, I'm gone because <laughs> we got to come back tomorrow at 12. So um, anything you want to say, Darcy, before we get, get started, honey? Nope, I'm pretty, pretty sure you said it all. Okay. And um, if you guys ever have any questions about your shipping or anything like that, please send me a sweet email inquiring before you charge at me um, and say something like, you must not want my business um, because that's disrespectful and you already put me uh, in defense mode when you do that. So I, I know none of you guys are, are like that, but I'm just saying in the future, it is always better to ask somebody and inquire nicely first 
I'm not saying you can't ever go off on somebody because I do it occasionally. I can't say it's right, but it does happen. Um, but just make sure that you inquire first because recently I had someone that did send me an email saying, you must not want my business. My shipping is too, your shipping is too high. I don't make the shipping prices. I just weigh it, measure it, plug it in and do what it tells me to do. Um, out of that, I have to pay a fee on, on that program also. So, you know, it, it gets expensive for me too. So I totally understand um, about shipping. It sucks all the way around. There's nothing good about it. That's why we use pirate ship because we, we put it in a box and then we put it a bag around it and it goes a lot cheaper. And if so, like if you guys ever have any questions, you can always, you know, catch us on Facebook or I check my messengers on Facebook every day, constantly. I'm always on there. If something pops up, I've got it. Boom. Um, Joycey's here. I haven't seen you in a while, Jocelyn. Um, and then, you know, that way, that way you can inquire first. The person may have made a mistake and can go back and look at it again. Um, that's what I usually do. I usually say, are you sure that's, that's right? It, can we look at it again? Can we measure, you know, maybe I could make a label cheaper using my service, anything to work with the person, but don't charge at them and say, you must not want my business because I'll be perfectly honest with you. I could care less about your business. If you don't like me, I totally get it. I am not liked by everybody. I am very outspoken. I'm very opinionated. And um, if you don't like me, that's fine. It's, it's actually not going to hurt my feelings at all. Um, I, I'm, I'm fine with it. So, um, but if you do, that's great too. I could be your best friend. And here we go. Let's get started. Just remember any questions, email us. We in no way, shape or form would ever send you an email charging after you for anything. It would be simply asking and inquiring. We, yeah, we are very, very kind, but you back us in a corner or you charge at us. And um, yeah, we're like mommies defending our babies. <laughs> so we, we are very, you know, we'll take care of it. That's for sure. We're not scared. Yeah. So here's Darcy. You ready, honey? Yeah, I'm just over here just to do one. <laughs> As I said, you know, I, I'm, I'm straight up honest on this thing. I don't try to, um, it's not staged. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put your friend Darcy up. And you guys just remember, every time you purchase something, whether it be from her or from me, I'm going to draw something out of my bag. You get a freebie with every item you purchase. Oh, okay. Sorry, there are poops, but we aren't like that. We are too awesome because so are y'all. You get what we give in life. We get what we give in life. Yeah, that's true. You guys are all precious. There's no doubt about it. But every now and then somebody gets on the rag or something and they have a bad day and they want to take it out on somebody. Well, I'm not, the two of us are not the people you want to do that to. I'll just say that. <laughs> we love you and we're very loving and kind and would never hurt anybody in the world. Uh, we have to answer for that someday. And actually when you get to heaven, you're going to feel the pain that you caused anyone else. Um, so I don't want to cause any pain, but uh, I will if I have to. <laughs> Yeah, make sure you're all sub to Darcy. Uh, eventually, she will start selling on her own channel. It won't happen right away, but, you know, I'm not going to be here forever. I'm going to get her trained. And uh, we love you. Here you go, Darcy. Yeah, I'm going to start maybe trying to do some um, pop-up videos. I'm starting to feel a little bit confident here. I don't want, I don't want to sound cocky by any means. But I'm feeling pretty good now. Because of these wonderful, wonderful, precious ladies that I have found friends in, you know. Okay, so anyhow, we have this, um, I don't know if this is, uh, it's kind of a funny color metal. Uh, kind of like a bronze and copper mix color. 
I don't know if that's really showing here. It's an 18 inch necklace with a three inch extender. Does that color really come up? And it doesn't really show up on the. It's lobster claw. There's the extender. And we're going to do this one for three dollars. It's really lightweight. Yeah, I don't know if it's. It kind of looks like a mixture of yes, okay. You, I guess you would say bronze, but then if you turn it a certain way, it's got a different um, like a slight copper kind of look. Like a mirrored copper look, but it, yes, it does look brown. Okay, I have book in at three dollars. Would anybody like to go to four? Get myself organized here. Book, I'm not sure if I have your information, dear. Is there any way that you could send me that? I'll send you my email over here. Got book in at three dollars. I'm gonna count it down. Five, four, three, two, one. Go in the book. I already take enough time. Poor Angie. Oh, book said loving your setup. And you take your all the time you need, honey. I'm I'm making jewelry over here at the same time. I'm watching a ball game. Thank you. Okay. Next we have this is extremely long. I'm going to show you here first. And it's kind of like a, a, a bronze color. Or, yeah, here we go. And then it's got like um, brown or natural color beads down here at the bottom. It's got kind of like a little dangly here. And I'm pretty sure that this is like a wood cutout pendant. There's little fuzzies on it where I was cleaning it. Just a nice layering necklace because it's an extremely long necklace. Let me measure this one for you. Yippee I yo, cow patties. Sounds good. This is a 36 inch necklace. Wonderful for layering. We're going to do this one for $2. Again, little wooden beads, little tassel, just a wooden pendant down there. Again, 36 inch chain. And we'll do this one for $2. Yeah, it is be nice for um, a layering piece like if you wanted to layer another wood necklace especially maybe even a shorter one that one's two and we have another longer necklace and this one has wood beads I don't know if this one's wood, but this one's wood. This one's probably acrylic. This one's wood. This one's wood. Wood disc. Another long necklace. Nice for layering. 
And we're going to do this one for $2 also. Oh, you can you see the pretty turquoise ones back there? There we go. Let me measure this one. Another 36, 36 inch necklace. Again, $2. And I believe it is Angie's turn. Okay. Um, who all something that round so at the end of the evening I can draw out freebies for everybody. I know Book bought something. Yeah, it was just Book. Okay. All right. At the end of the night, we will draw out however many items you bought out of my free jar. First up, I have an Avon pearl necklace. You can see the length of it here is a nice length. It's graduated, and they also have a knot in between each one. It is vintage and marked. And this is going to be, or start, at $4. I love the length of that. It is such a good length. Um, they're nice and clean. Nice and clean. <laughs> Sorry, he was taking the dogs out. Very pretty. Just a lovely necklace. I, what, what else can I say? And Anna Mora is here. Welcome, welcome, Anna. So that, just type in pearls if you want the pearls. Oh, hey, Chicago lady. Welcome. Thank you for coming, honey. And then I have a stretch ring. This looks to be like artisan made, but it is a red cameo ring. And this is going to be $2. Sure, you can book. And I have it also in case you forget. I can get it right to her. All right, books in at two. If anybody wants to come in at three, let me know. If you want to get in on this, we need to see a $3 bid. It's as cute as a button. Five, four, three, two, one. Sold to book for $2. Congratulations, book. And thank you. All right, and next up, I have some beads. Now, you're going to get all of this for $5. You're going to get these, uh, I think they're called millifori beads because they're made, they're glass made with flowers in them. These are a beautiful green, like a watermelon. It's a whole string of them. And then we have these purple glass beads. They're kind of iridescent. And I have two packs of those with this. And then I have these white um, glass beads. Whole bunch of them. Beautiful glass beads. So you're going to get all four packages of beads. Brand new, never opened, for $5. 
Yeah, somehow or another, they, they said that they make it in the glass. It's made into the glass. I don't know how that would be done, but... Yeah, they're called Nellifori. You can look it up if you want and should tell how to do it. But look how cute they are. They look like little watermelon with flowers on them. I mean, would those not make adorable earrings? I just have thousands and thousands, and I've got to start moving some of them out. So if you're interested in these, they just put in beads. If you're interested in the pearl necklace, just put in pearls. The ring is already gone, guys. Sorry. Miss Book will be wearing it. These purple are like an iridescent purple. They really are beautiful. And I love these with the silver on them. You could actually put these in between. All right. And that is my three. We're moving back over to Darcy. I'm so glad that I was on mute. I'm pretty sure I, I let a little curse word slip. All of all is over here playing and everything she's not supposed to. Is it a little curse word for you? Yes. Well, you know what I mean. A little curse word? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Lord, strike me dead if you need to, but <laughs> I know there is no suffering when you get to heaven, but I have read a lot of after uh, people that died and came back to life and said that they actually did, the Lord let them feel what the people felt like when they hurt them. And that hurt, you feel their hurt, and it's really opens up your eyes as to what it's like to hurt someone. So be careful when you hurt someone. You will feel it again, possibly. Oh, absolutely. So I'm pretty sure this is Avon. It doesn't say Avon, but you know the little um, copyright mark, the little C, or the little, you know, dot looking. Yeah. Anywho, this is about two inches. It's a little angel stick pen. And we're going to do this one for, let's do $4. And I'll show you the back. Here we go. There is one, two, three, four rhinestones up at the top, and they're all there. Down there at the very bottom is that little copyright at the bottom. Yes, Avon. Let's do three dollars. Get this little get this little beauty out of my face and give it to somebody who likes angels. Wonderful condition. There's that. Okay. These were sold as $10 when they was purchased. And God knows when. So we are going to do a start bed of 10. These are gold 14 carat. <clears throat> 14 carat gold filled post. Brand new, still on the card. I'll measure one and let you know how big they are. Okay. 
about an inch to an inch and a quarter. Fourteen karat gold post. And it is made in Korea. Here's that. And we have this three layers. An extremely long silver tone and faux pearl necklace. We're going to do this one for $3. I don't know if that's. Here we go. Nope, it's still fuzzy. Oh, come on. Hold on here. There we go. It's a wonderful condition. And it is a, overall it's 44 inches if you measure it from the top to the bottom. But the first, the first necklace, it hits at 32 and it has an extender. I don't know why you need an extender after 32 inches, but we're going to do this one for $3. Yes, this one is pretty, very pretty. It's still in wonderful condition. This one would look pretty with like a brooch. Since it's got three um three layers, hooking a brooch over here to the side, you know, an asymmetrical, just hooking a brooch over here. We have this Chico set, the necklace and the earrings, and it's on this faux leather cord. And it's about 16 inch with a orange extender. At least it goes to 20 inches. Mm. I don't know if you can really see how that sparkles inside. Let's do this for $6 for the set. And that same pattern is in the earrings. Yeah, I'm t let me tell you, you know, like, um, I don't even have anything right here around me, but a, like something pink and, and flowery, something really girly would actually look real pretty off to the side of that. So, anywho. <laughs> Chico's necklace and earring set. Hi, Natalie Robinson. Welcome. You're a new one for me. Welcome. Thank you for joining. Right now we have a Chico's necklace and earring set for $6. And... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Just 
try again. There's the tag. And that is my three, Angie. Did you hear me, Ange? Your turn, dear. All right, let's see. How do I do this? Okay, there we go. Is that your three? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> I was looking for something. You know how that goes. Never find it. Okay. These are vintage uh, clip-on Japan, marked Japan, J-A-P-I-N. They're blue and white milk glass. Very precious. These are going to be $4. Just type in clips or Japan or something to, to let me know. They're so sweet. And then I have a necklace that I made. It is gunmetal chain, brand new chain with an extender and it's in a bottle. And there's beautiful glass beads in there and real stone beads and then I put some of those um, uranium beads in there so they glow and this is going to be eight dollars it's long and a little jar so freaking cute thank you I bought this from Teresa's sale it's vintage and then I have a necklace. Oh, this one is a good one. This one is going to be $6. It's got halite stones all through it. And even some red ones. All the way up. All the way up. All the way up. And there's your clasp. And this is what it looks like. So beautiful. And this one is six dollars lots of halide on there halide is a natural stone just like turquoise or anything else but they dye it it's usually white and this one is only six dollars and darcy um who did anybody buy anything on your last round that i need to give a gift to no ma'am okay I'll just let you tell me. I won't ask you that and bug you. It has little beads in between each halite stone. Oh, I love this necklace. All right. That is my three. If you're interested in any of those three items, please let me know. Thank you, book. I I made two or three of them. I haven't listed them online yet. Um, I really, to tell you the truth, haven't had time. I've been so busy, but um, I think they're awesome. I really do. I have some smaller ones too. Okay, and we're going back to you, Darcy. Thank you, Book. That's so nice of you to, to be thoughtful like that, honey. This is an artisan-made necklace. This is, um, has to be some kind of clay or resin. It looks like a starfish flower some kind of shell and i'm not sure if this is just a leaf or some other kind of shell pattern over here and then it's got um little rhinestones that's beautiful indented in it 
I checked some of these um, glass beads up here. They look like amber down there. I just I just checked them and nothing um nothing nothing was glowing that I could see. Hey Penny, thank you for stopping by, honey. But I will measure this, and I'm gonna do this one for four dollars. It's got a spring ring clasp, and it's about a 15 inch necklace. There's glass beads, wooden beads, glass seed beads. I don't know if those little ones are clay beads. Again, artisan made necklace, 15 inch for $4. I didn't measure this one yet either. This one's a nice um, kind of copperish tone. Two pendants. Then there is, those have to be glass, ceramic, glass. I don't think that's a real pearl. Acrylic beads. It's got three chains on this side. Just the one chain on the other. Let me get it back here so you can see it. There we go. We're going to do this one for $4. Doesn't have an extender. It's got a spring. No, lobster claw. Let me measure this. A 19 inch necklace. Mm -hmm. The design's cut out on this one, and then the pins at the top is all it's completely whole. Again, that one's four. And we have this one, I just need to put the class back on there. It came apart right up here at the top. It's one easy little fix. I just need to tighten the, the spring ring back. Yeah. Never mind, I see a hair stuck in it. This one looks like it's on a suede cord. It looks like it's handmade. It is 14 inch necklace with a two inch extender. It looks like you got these little coins or something at the bottom. Seed beads. Cute little necklace. Little coins down here at the bottom. Suede seed beads. That's the back. Looks like it was like threaded up here at the top. Let's do um, three dollars on it. Cute little necklace. And I'm pretty sure it's now back to Angie. There goes that finger. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make it on Angie's turn. <laughs> All right.
we have a beautiful necklace here. Let's see if I got it straightened. These are howlite also, if you can see the lines in there. It's dyed howlite. And this necklace is brand new. One of the boutique necklaces. It has an extension. And we'll start this at two dollars. It's all highlight howlites, all the beads. Should I turn the ball game off? <laughs> it's no fun. I don't know why it seems like it's hanging weird. And then I have a, a ladybug brooch with um, red enamel, black enamel, and rhinestones. And she is brand new and she's $3. Just type in bug. Oh, yeah, Natalie, I remember now. And then this is a bangle, silver tone with silver tone beads all the way around. And this is going to be $2, starting $2. It's everything is, is that price, but if someone else wants it, we'll bid on it. So this one is three and this one is two and the necklace is two. Only because I need to let things get out of here. Get out of here. And that's my three. We're going back to you, Darcy. I think this is a necklace. If it if if it's if it's about somebody's got an awful tiny waist. It's a thirty inch. It might be about right. Let's put it up here. So this is 30 inches. It's got some weight to it. We're going to do this one for $4. And I will show you the hook on the back. The hook looks like if it was a vintage um, necklace, that type of hook. Got it, book. Does anybody want to go in at five? Where did the bag go? Aha. Uh -huh.
Why was the messages deleted? Is something wrong? Angie? What? I accidentally threw your books away. Okay. I was making sure. <laughs> making sure something wasn't wrong. So I had book in at four for this necklace. Did you block her or just accidentally delete her messages? Okay. Okay. Book, I have you at four. I still see her at four. Uh, on my end, it, it says uh, it says messages deleted. It's okay. It's okay. I was just making sure something wasn't wrong. Well, that's weird because it doesn't say that for me. It, it, it's okay, Tammy. It's okay. So I have book in at four going once, going twice, going three times. At least sold. Sold the book. <laughs> I'm over here in La La Land, not paying attention over there. So, you guys got to tell me if something's going on. Ooh. Congratulations, book. Look, dear, I don't think I have your information. What do I do with it? Oh. We have this necklace. This is a about an eighteen. With a two inch extender, so about 20 inch necklace. It's pretty much brand new. It is on a um, like suede cord, half of it is. So the top part is like on a suede cord, then you've got the silver tone bar, then you have um, little crystals with an 80 coating down and through here. And then you have these little pendants, and these have um, suede going through them. And we're going to do this one for $5. Let's so me turn this leaf around. Here, I'll put it up closer to see if you can see. There we go. Oh, my kitty cat girl is here. Welcome, welcome. Hello. So again, Our this one's Crafty Kitty Vintage's name is Leanne. Hello, Leanne. Thank you for stopping. Again, this one's five dollars. Believe me, I'm not doing justice to this necklace. And I believe this is Angie's turn. All right. Okay. Maintain my composure here. All right, this is a Coisonne bracelet um, clamper. It is marked Fish F I S H. You can look it up if you'd like. 
This is going to be 15. Beautiful, beautiful, and excellent condition. If you like cloisonne. And here I have some lovely for pierced ears, halided beads, dyed halide, and a teardrop shape. Very understated, but noticeable because they are just as cute as a button. And we are going to let these go for two bucks. And all you have to do is type in earrings or bracelet, and I'll know what you're talking about. Now up here, I have some seed beads all in a big bundle necklace with silver tone beads. Here's your clasp. It does have an extension. And this one is going to be $3. Seed beads are in. They are in, baby. You want a cute necklace for $3? Get it here. Get it while you can get it. You can use this as a Christmas present. It is brand new, never been worn. Same with the earrings, they kind of match. And cloisonne is always a winner in jewelry. Yes, seed beads are in, babies. I love the seed bead earrings. Where it is at. All right, we got Tammy for the earrings. Unless someone else comes in for them, you they are sold to you for two dollars. I don't see anyone coming in for them, so sold. Ding, ding dong. You know it, baby. You know it. This is a beautiful, beautiful bracelet. Even the band has cloisonne all around. I will put this online for about $25. All right. We sold the earrings to Tammy. And Tammy, um, you're going to get, get in the jar at the end of the night. And I have booked for three things out of the jar. Is that right, Darcy? I, I have her. I have her for two things. And then I sold one to her. So it's okay. Jar. Woo -hoo! All right. We're going back to you, my love. Now pay attention, guys. Yes, book. Um, Darcy, let me set, tell you something real quick. I have books info. I'll just pass it on to you because I have it all on one little email. Okay. This is a um, silver tone long like Y necklace. I'm trying to hold it back here so you can get the view of it. Thank you, Tammy. I forgot to say thank you. That bad of you. <laughs> Is this like an upside down diamond shape? Then we go down here. It's just a little dangling with some rhinestones. Up here's also got uh, rhinestones. Oh, come on. Can you see the rhinestones? 
There we go. Maybe now. Two dollars. Silver tone. Rhinestones. Little tiny dangling pendant with rhinestones. Lobster claw. Long extender. Hold on and I'll measure it. It's a wonderful condition. There's no maker. It's a 14 inch with a 3 inch extender. So it's going to be 17 inches. It's going to be a little bit, you know, up closer to your neck. This is going to be closer up, up here. And then this is going to dangle down. $2. Yeah, I'm a hot mess too. That's why I'm hiding. So anyway, $2 necklace right here. Let me just put it in here before I mess it up. We should probably already have. Okay. Here is another cute little necklace. It's three different chains. These are kind of like a turquoise color with a um, olive green. This is a little lock. This is a little key. It's a cute little necklace. We're going to do this one for $2 too. Silver tone. I'll measure it. Welcome back, Donna. It's going to be a 12. It's going to be about a 15 inch from the class to this first necklace. $2. Got Tammy in. I don't know what I've done with the bag. Got Tammy in it too. Does anybody want to go any higher? Going once. Going three times. Pull the Tammy. I believe this is a um, Simply Rare Wang. This is Gold Tone. And these are like faceted. Makes them sparkle a little bit more. It's a wonderful condition. We're going to do this one for $2 also. Lobster claw. There's the back. It has a little bit of weight to it, but not extremely heavy. If that makes any sense. It's a 14 inch necklace with a Two inch extender, so you got about a 16 inch necklace. Again, I think that's Vera. Simply Vera, that little bead looking thing. 
got that. Oh, okay. So there's that one. And I believe that it is Angie's turn. All right, we got a jingle, jingle necklace here, buddy. Isn't that beautiful? It's double layered. These are acrylic. There's some that look like glass, though. Maybe they're all glass. I think they're all glass. Yeah, they're cold. So stripe the acrylic thing and put in glass. And um, here is your class. Plenty of room to grow or ungrow. And this is going to be three dollars for this gorgeous necklace. Let what go? What's going on? Okay. All right. These are so cute. I would think these would be neat for Halloween. They're just little beaded vintage earrings. Marked Japan right there and they are just so cute i don't know what else to say about them they're just so cute wouldn't those be cute at halloween these are five dollars they're in excellent condition they're vintage these are going to be three dollars they are brand new these could even be a gift because they are new and they're three dollars very cute for the holidays yeah absolutely adorable One of a kind pieces. This is a double layer. Nice chunky chain. It hangs really cool. It could go with blue, white. Um, I would even wear this with blue jeans and a white t shirt. Wouldn't that be cute? Only $3 today. And if you're interested in the necklace, just put in necklace or the clip-ons or the seed bead earrings. And we're going back to you, Darcy. This is a 30-inch necklace. It's got some wear to the clasp in the back, that part of the chain that's towards the clasp uh, and maybe some um, all around but this has got a pretty tassel let me tell you somebody might want to take that tassel off and, and use it to make a set of earrings or use it on a different necklace oops sorry there's like rhinestones at the top all around. They're all there. We're going to do this one for $2. Yeah, they're all there. They go all the way around. 
Those would be pretty earrings. Oh, yeah, one chain is longer than the other, but still you could chop it off to make a pretty pair of earrings if you wanted. Or like I said, use it on a different necklace. Again, $2. It does have wear. There's that one. We have this one, which is multi multi tone <laughs> with. Oh, I love that. Three different. So is here. Welcome, Crystal. Long time no see. And it's got different um, different elements on it, like um, different leaves, different shapes of leaves, and the markings on the leaves are different. It's like a brass tone and a silver tone. Again, three different chains. It's got a, wow, that's a long extender too. We're going to do this one for three inch extender. We're going to do this one for $3. It's a wonderful condition. And I will measure the whole necklace. Again, $3. The 16 inch to the first chain with the three inch extender. And my third one is a choker necklace. It is a gold mesh tone. Wonderful condition. I'll clasp this down here. And I'll measure it. A 17 inch. That's how you put it on and off. Good, 17 inch. Gold mesh choker necklace. We're going to do this one for five dollars. And I believe that is my three, Angie. All right, this is a necklace that I made. Um, This has a, um, a real stone. I can't remember what the name of the stone is right now. I'm using my phone and it's on there. Um, these are real stones and these are glass beads, but it's all the way up and it is long. You can see how long it is. I think it's beautiful. And this one is going to be $10 tonight. It's greens and yellows kind of all together. This is like a light green with a yellow look like a moon glow. And then this has some yellow and then this has the same color green. They just all kind of go together. And I did put a clasp on it, so oh, shit. So you, I mean, I'm sorry. So you do not have to um, put it over your head if you're not if you're one of them people that hates to do that. Which you know, there are people that do hate to do that because they don't want to mess up their hair, and I get that. Totally get that. Sorry, I didn't mean to say the bad word, but it just came out. Yeah, thank you everyone for coming. 
And then this is just a cute little bracelet from the boutique and it is going to be $3. It has an extension on it. It is seed beads and it is brand new. So this would be a nice gift. Oh, I guess I should, could put the camera down here so you could see it. That would help, wouldn't it? So you can make this any size you want. Oh, you're in the hospital, Crystal. I'm so sorry, baby. Oh. These are um, felted earrings that I made for pierced ears. And these are going to be $6. So cute. Beautiful colors for the holiday. You can see that it's kind of like a little roll. These are called sausage rolls. When you do felting, you'll know what I'm talking about. Very unique, very different, one of a kind. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Yes, we are so glad that you're back, honey. I hope everything is okay. You should have told me you were going in the hospital. We would have put you in our prayers. All right, that's my three, and we're going back to you, Darcy. Okay, this is going to, um, I'm only going to do this one, and then you can go next, because this is going to take a minute. It's a ring lot. <clears throat> this one's about a seven and a half. It's got pink, dark pink and light pink crystals. These are all fashion rings. Some you can use in crafting. Some are nice and wearable now. What are you smacking me for? No. Sorry. That's the first one. You've got this little vintage one that is a size seven and a half, and it's got like green and white crystals. You've got like the old plastic rings that used to get in the bubblegum machines. Um. I don't know what this one is. Six and a half. Um, I don't know what material this one is either. I did not test it. This one's a size seven. This one's just like a little silver tone band. Size eight with rhinestones. This one is a, oh, it looks like 11. It's gorgeous. This one's got wear to it. There is some that, of course, they're not immaculate condition. These are just fashion rings that there's a lot of them. And I just need them out of my face. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do the start bed on these for five dollars. There's a lot of them. You see all this right here in front of my face. That one's not in there. Here's this little black metal, size nine. That one's not. Here's this little faux turquoise with rhinestones. Flowers. This is um, like a two, two finger ring. There's a couple stretch rings in here. Of course, this one needs cleaned. I didn't test this one either. 
So you, you never know what you might find in here. Size eight, little band. Here's another little stretch ring. Here's a copper ring. Size eight. Another little band with some rhinestones. A little ring with hearts and rhinestones. Bow pearl and some rhinestones. Cute little metal. This one, I believe, is a mood ring. A little tiny pinky ring. There's just a little enamel ring. Looks like a little toe ring. There's a couple little kids' rings in here. I can't even grab them for yet. Another little band. I don't even know what it is. There is a cute little chevron type ring. And a little ring that says love. Um, I didn't test this one either. Another little silver band. Um, a little ring that says princess. Another little toe ring that um, has a flip-flop on it. Another little um, plastic ring. Another little stretch ring. That one's not. Here's this gorgeous little glass ring. Another toe ring. Here's a double... Double band ring. Here's this ring. Another little ring that says princess. Here's another rhinestone ring. Another faux turquoise ring. And two rings that you could probably use for crafting. So, all of those rings for a start bid of $5. Oh. There's these two little um, Sea Beach stretch rings. I don't know if that's like an infinity symbol ring. And this is like a black gunmetal with rhinestone ring. All of those rings for a start bit of five. I got you, book. It's, it's hard to tell what you're going to find in your book. I didn't mess with none of it. I didn't test none of it. I wanted it out of my face. Anybody want to go in it thick? If not, book's going to get all these rings for $5, and you never know what she might find. Wayne wants the book for 5 Going twice. Can't see sizes. Oh, a lot of them were size seven to nine, and then there was some smaller ones and some kids and some pinky sizes. Sorry. Did you need, need me to go back through these later for you? Mm 
most of these were between a seven and a nine. And then there was some smaller ones, like in, in this, and kids, kids size smaller. Are you still in at five? Yes or no book? <clears throat> Okay. Somebody yell at me, like say something on the screen so I know because I don't know if I'm going too fast. Please and thank you. Going once for book. Going twice. Three times. Sold the book for five dollars. Angie's turn. <laughs> oh, God, you're funny. Ring <laughs> In case you can't hear me. I can hear you. I'm sitting right here. <laughs> you can see that white sign, too. <laughs> I can't. Don't let me fool you. <laughs> okay. Here's what I have this round. These are Coro, C O R O, vintage screw back and marked Coro. They are the most beautiful earrings I've ever seen in my life. Honestly, I have never seen an earring so freaking beautiful. And these are going to be $10 because if they don't get sold, I don't mind keeping them till and putting them in my casket with me. All you have to do is say, Coro, this is a very vintage enamel flower brooch. It is um, the old metal. And the good thing about this, guys, is... It, there's no chipping on the enamel or anything, even on the center. It it looks excellent. Yeah, and this one is going to be ten dollars. It's vintage and it's in perfect condition and it's huge. That would make a wonderful gift too. These are also $10. These are sterling silver with a turquoise center and they're screw backs. And they're tarnished, so they need cleaned. Somebody buy them and clean them. What color are the petals? The petals are like a dark greenish yellow like a dark greenish yellow it's a beauty I'm going to tell you how big this brooch is um, as soon as I find my measuring stick 
That's a measuring stick. <laughs> oh, we don't say that. We say measuring doohickey around here. Where's the measuring doohickey? Here it is. I got it. This flower is all oh, three and a half tall. No, it's not because it has like an iridescent look in the petals. And you can see on the very edges how the yellow kind of comes through. Maybe if I move that dish. Mama called. And the earrings, the pin, and the sterling silver earrings. It's going to be your choice, guys. Ten dollars. And if you'd like all three, I could do twenty-five. I'm not afraid. What a deal! What a steal! And let me know if you're interested because we're going back on over to Darcy. She's got some more stuff to show you guys. So if you have any questions about any of these, these earrings are really neat. They're kind of like a hubcap. I don't know. They're kind of like Southwestern, you would say. Yeah, I would say. And I know I paid more than that for them, but... You know, I'm retiring at the end of the year. This stuff has got to go somewhere. So we're going back to you, Darcy. I don't have a sign. <laughs> oh, I'll make one. Hold on. I'll, I'll make I'll make one for next time. <laughs> We have the stretch bracelet. Oh, hmm. There we go. It has turtles. Little turtles around it. It's just silver tone. I don't even know what size this uh, elastic seems really nice. We're, we're just going to do this one for a dollar. Because it probably does have some wear on it. And again, it's just silver tone with little turtles. Okay. This is a, let me make sure again. I just, just done it. Five and a half. It's a little shell. It's made out of shell. Mother of Pearl. Ring? Nope. Oh, come on. You're blurry. You're blurry. Yep, still blurry. Let me go over here. It's still blurry. Oh, for the love of Jesus. Is 
I still worry. Nope, I get up. No, I don't. Let's see if I can't do it with this. There. Now, is it blurry? This is a size five and a half mother of pearl ring, Rochelle. Here we go. Now it'll flash. It's just a little carved ring. So we've got that, and it's going to go with. This is just a little cord necklace with a barrel clasp. And this is um I don't know if that's angel skin coral. That's a little carved turtle. We're gonna do both pieces for a start bit at five dollars. I'll measure the little turtle. He is about an inch and a quarter. Show you his back. Here's that. This one's a sterling silver clasp. These are hematite. That's a little shell necklace. We're doing this one for $8. Just the back of the shell. Drilling findings, and I'll measure the necklace for you. Fifteen inch for seven dollars. Angie's turn. <laughs> you <goof. laughs> Oh, you're fun. Okay. All right. I have some sterling silver rings. Actually, they're getting low on them. I'm going to have to get some more. This one is size five. And it's a moonstone. Make sure it is a size five. Yes. It's just a little, actually, five and a quarter. This one is 15. Rings! Yay! Um, Oliver dot Gia. Let me put it up. There you go. And then this one is a size five and a half. We're getting bigger. This one is blue topaz. And 
this one is going to be fifteen dollars. And then this one is blue topaz, but it is much bigger. It is a little over an eighth. And it's fifteen dollars. First knuckle. So we have a five moonstone, five and a half blue topaz and an eight blue topaz. All three sterling silver, all three fifteen dollars. You this one is a I believe it's an eight. Yeah, it's an eight. If you're interested and you're a reseller, you can have all three for thirty. Eight fits this finger on me. We need a four and a half. Wow. Yeah, this is blue topaz. This is blue topaz. And this is moonstone. I love moonstone so much. I think they're perfect prices, considering I'm not making a dime. <laughs> oh, that's true, too. <laughs> the crazy things we do. All right, that's my three. If you guys are interested in any of those three, you can let me know throughout the program. <laughs> We're going back to you. <laughs> Come on back. <laughs> You are a nut. <laughs> hey, we got to have some humor in this world. Just saying. Oh, wait a minute. I got to go back. <laughs> <laughs> Moonstone up close. Moonstone up close, Tammy. Whoa. Uh, if I get up real up close for some reason, we get a problem. Oh, man. I love my All right, we're really coming back to you now. <laughs> Come on back. <laughs> oh, Tammy wants the moonstone. You got it, girl. I hope you enjoy it. Put it in your bag right now. Thank you, darling. If anyone's interested in the other two, please let me know. We have a, it's a vintage. Is that yeah, a club? Is that a club? What is that? That is a three leaf clover. Yeah, okay, well, whatever it is. It's a club. It's so it still has this card. It says sterling silver plate. It's a 15 inch necklace. It has the spring ring clasp. And we're going to do it for $5. Laura says it's a shamrock. Thank you, Laura. Moon woman. You're new to me, honey. 
Welcome. Thank you for coming. Again, still has this tag, sterling silver plated, 15 inches. And we're going to do it for $5. This one's silver tone. It is 14. The 14 inch necklace with a two and a half inch extender. I don't know if this is a black cat eye. And it's not going to show one. If I'm looking at it, it, it looks like a cat eye on my end. But I don't know if it, it yeah, there you go. We're going to do this one for $4. Silver tone. Let me completely open it up and see how long this is. Okay, that's an 18 inch necklace. There we go. I was like, that can't be that small. You've got an 18 inch necklace, silver tone, black cat eye for $4. This is a set that I put together. Can't really see it. It matches perfectly. I think it looks nice. You got about a 17 inch necklace. It's a pretty gold color shells. Here's the necklace. Oh, she said she did a search on lives and we came up. Oh, wow. And book, you are so sweet. That's so sweet of you to say. I matched it with this bracelet. There is one shell that has a boo-boo right there still in wonderful stretch condition except that little boo-boo on that one shell i matched it with that and then i matched it with these earrings it could use a little cleaning i'm not gonna lie matched it with these earrings you're gonna get all three pieces for four dollars Earrings, necklace, bracelet. Beautiful set. This is a really pretty necklace. There's a little there's a little dirt on the cord. You could always take the pendant off. It's one of like the I guess you call it Shambhala. 
you tighten it. I just got the Tree of Life pendant. This one's so pretty, though. We're going to do this one for $2. The cord is dirty. But this pendant is in wonderful condition. Pull that off and put that on a different necklace. I'll measure it for you. Two and a quarter inches. You could also use this in a crafting piece. You wanted to add your own stones to it. Got a book at two dollars. Game book, like I said, there's it's not extreme dirt, extremely dirty. I just I see dirt. So and there's dirty up here, so just so you know that the cord is dirty. So I got book in at two. Does anybody want to go to three? If not, I'm gonna call it the book. Going once. Going twice. Going three times. Sold the book for two dollars. I put her down another dip in the star. Yeah. No, she said her symbols are her jam. My goodness, book. If you see my little thing over here with all these symbols and charm thingies. Oh. I'll have to get that out sometime. What did you think? Oh. Okay. No. Yes. No. And this necklace is an extremely long necklace. It's got some wear on it. Wow. 36 inch necklace. It's got this nice pendant at the bottom. Nice layering piece. Because of the wear, we're going to do this one for $2. It's got wear on the chain in the back. And I don't know if this pendant was made to look like it's worn out. It's actually kind of cute pendant the way it is. You could add some elements to the necklace. Make it really cute. Again, it's a 36 inch necklace for $2. It's two chains up into here, and then it's got these beads, and then it goes into one chain. Lobster claw. There you go. I ain't judging nobody. You got that?
Those look like you need coins. Look, you do you. You just do you if we're happy. Donna, you can come and go. Art, I do the same thing. We got you. Yeah. These are some unusual looking earrings. They kind of look like dragon scales, if you ask me. About an inch and three quarters. Really vintage. Gonna use them two dollars. You know them as some like late eighties earrings. All right, I believe it's Angie's turn. And that, <laughs> that is so freaking funny. I can't help it. <laughs> Book, I can't believe they would lose all, your dental plate of all things. Oh. She should be able to file a claim on that one. Uh, I would hope and haunt them. <laughs> okay. I have a choice of. So these are going to be a choice of. These are brooches. And this one has um, colored rhinestones. Purple, blue, silver. You name it. It has it. And these are going to be a choice up for $3. This one has AB crystals all over it. I mean, the most beautiful AB crystals. Look at that. I can't. I just can't. AB crystals. Silver tone. This one has a great big nugget size crystal with little pink um i don't know what that what you would call them i guess they're rhinestones and this one this is going to be a choice up for three dollars just type in three dollars first and you'll get your choice first There's three here, Crystal. <laughs> she said me for both. <laughs> Crystal, there's three. <laughs> Which one or ones do you want, Crystal? <laughs> I don't know why everybody's funny to me tonight. You want them all. You want three brooches for nine dollars. All right, Crystal. I'll put those in your little bag. Thank you, thank you. All right, and now for those that love butterflies, this is a little um, brass, I would say, butterfly. Has little antennas up there really sweet these are also going to be three dollars choice of this one is beautiful too it's gold tone look how petite that is so sweet and then this one is a big gold tone one it's beautiful too all 
Oh, bless your heart. You know, you guys know that anytime you bring somebody that's never been here before, I am, I will put a new, a brand new brooch in your order as a gift for bringing someone. And that that's for any show I do. And Leanne, if you're still here, Darcy and I would like to do a show with you on your channel. If that's okay, can you just email me and let me know when? We're reaching out to other resellers so that we can gain new people. It's just part of the biz. I was being transported from one hospital to another by a private ambulance. All three could have lost them. All three said they didn't see them. I was hurting too much. Oh. Oh. So nobody likes sweet little butterflies. These are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. See that on your jacket. Angie. Yes, honey. Um, can you please let, excuse me for just a minute so I go get some more water? Oh, of course. Take go, like, take an extra turn, please. Okay. okay. Thank you. Uh-huh. All right. So we're going to move the little butterflies. They're going to fly away and flutter, flutter, flutter. Bye-bye, butterflies. How about some animals? These are going to be five each. This is the cutest little gold tone dog. Almost looks like a Scotty, doesn't it? With an enamel bowl, bow, B-O-W. Oh. oh, I'm sorry, Leanne, honey. You just let me know whenever it's convenient for you. And this is a sweet little dog. I'm not sure it could be a Pekingese. Gold tone. I have thousands of brooches, guys. <laughs> so we have two dogs, and here comes the cock. Cock a doo and And he is, he looks like kind of like um, Cloisonne style. Gold tone. And these are going to be five choice of. We would love that too, Leanne. Crazy father problems. Oh, I, I feel for you, honey. I'm going to put you in my prayers. All right. So she wants me to go again. I'm going to do so. How about some Christmas brooches? This is one of my favorites. This is a Monet. It's got little hanging um, pine cones on it and a bow that has rhinestones in it. See how the little pine cones hang on there? And it's marked Monet. And we're going to do $10 on it. It's in new condition. It's a beauty. Nice, sturdy, heavy piece. This one is three drummers, three drums. Nice, heavy, gold tone piece. And we're going to do four on it. Oh, it's scrolling across there. Hi, Sharon. How are you? Sharon wants the rooster. You got it. Let me put you down. Sharon Rooster, $5. You could have said, hi, Sharon. Thank you, Donna. Yeah, I've had back surgery, too. So this is one of those um, articulated, I guess they call it. I don't know. Santa Claus, he's enamel. He's not marked, but he is a nice piece and he's made very well. And he's going to be $5. So we have Santa, 
We have the Monet wreath and we have the three drums. Sharon, you were hiding from me. This is a beautiful Monet piece. Read above the rooster comment. Sharon, me, rooster, is that what you wanted me to read? Donna, is that what you wanted me to read? I got Sharon for the rooster. Okay, I'll bring these out again closer to Christmas, I guess. <laughs> and let's see if Darcy's back. She's back. <laughs> Oh, she's cracking me up. Who said? <laughs> okay. I had to get some snacks too. I found some Twizzlers, you know. Gotta have candy around here. There's five little brooches in here, and I'm pretty sure they're all butterflies. I. This one was plastic. The little butterfly wing got bent. But we're going to do five of them with a start bit of $5. This is the first one. And again, you see where his little wing, wing was um, bent. There's that one. Here is the second one. There is um, some scratching on one of the wings of the enameling. Here's the second one. Here's the third one. I love this one. It's just a little pin. But it's little... It's little rhinestones. And they're prong set. And there was this one. It's double butterfly with blue rhinestones. And then there's this one, which is another pin again. But this is a butterfly with a cross. And again, this is a butterfly pin lot. Start bit of $5. This is a gold tone bracelet. It is eight inches long. It is a Ralph Lauren. This is the link. We're gonna do this one for $4. There is wear on the toggle. There is your signature right there. And there's wear. Again, that trial floor. This 
This is a gold tone bracelet. I don't know that I've ever really seen one like this. Looks like you can add charms to it. I don't know. Huh. Anywho, there's this little blue stone right here. There's little two tags, and one is a heart, one is a circle. Don't know who the maker is. I'm just going to do this one for a dollar. And I'm pretty sure that is my three. I tried to hurt but her sign up. My email's scrolling across the screen. <laughs> What's going on? I don't know. Ugh. All right, so I have a turtle enamel J. Crew bracelet. Really cute. This is going to be six dollars. Got enamel turtles all the way around it. And it's marked J. Crew right there. Aww. Oh, I know it's precious. And then I have this gold tone. Monet, yeah, Monet. I have this gold tone Monet. It's in excellent condition. It is marked. And this is also going to be $6 tonight. Then I have a rhinestone ankle bracelet for three. It is brand new, so it could be a gift. It has an extension on it. So sweet on your ankle. Tiniest font in history. <laughs> uh, oh, that would be cute. I always think of you when I see kitty cat things. And that's my three. We're going back to you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll try to work on that. <laughs> what does anybody want to see? What time is it? 9-12. Huh? 9-12. Oh, okay. Is anyone in there? Hello? What does anybody want to see? Is anyone there? 
Remember that pink voice? You probably. Come on, get up here. You, no, you gotta sit down. You gotta sit down. Come on. You call stuck in my shirt. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Can you lay down? Can you lay down? Come on. You want to see jewelry? Bracelets. Okay. Here, you want your tiny bracelet? And the so crap it is asleep. This is actually oh, No! She, she was getting me bite it. I'm gonna make you get down, no ma'am. This is actually you cannot bite the jewelry. Now sit down. She wants to help. You want to help her. That's the cutest thing I ever saw. Pretty sure this is an anklet. This is a 10 inch, a very, very dainty Figaro. It has a heart charm and it has a off of one little off of one little um, chain it has a heart charm and then off of another little chain it has a T. You hear that, Tammy? A T with I think they're I think they're little rhinestones, but I do have the gym tester on, so I'll go test it. And I would do this for $18. Hold on, and I'll show you here. I might show up on here. It needs cleaned. Again, it's an anklet, sterling silver, a little Figaro. It's a tiny Figaro. Off of, one, off of one little chain is a heart, and then off another little chain is the T. And I'm going to go check these to see what they are. It is all sterling silver. And I will do this for $18. $18. Look, I said 18. And if you give me a minute, when I go to get up, I'll test it so I, I can tell you exactly what those stones are. They might even be diamonds. I'm not sure. What size book, book, what size rings did you say you're looking for? Mm -hmm. Hey, Angie, why don't you go again so I can... Pull some stuff out and go touch these stones for them. Yes, <laughs> she just bosses here all the time. No, no, listen. Now, listen. You just listen. Listen. Just look at this. Would you just look at this? Look at that. Just look at that. Oh, I had some coffee, but I forgot I had it. And now it's all cold. 
bitches, jeepers, weepers. We all have our bitches. Uh, I had a doctor's appointment today, and I'm feeling great that I kept it, because if I had canceled one more time, they probably would have just canceled me. Oh, I do not look forward to it. But thankfully, I didn't have to get undressed on this one. We just talked. And that made me happy. I like talking. What size rings are you looking for, Bookie Wookie? One or two, she said. Damn small. All right. I got some more vintage earrings for those vintage lovers in you. Hong Kong. Look at these. These are adorbs. These are going to be $3. I don't know why. I just feel generous. Oh, these are Bellinis. Bellini. Okay, how about these? These are not marked. But they have a copper backing. Yes. Vintage, 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 luscious vintage. Let's just do $3 choice of... These are also vintage clips. These are marked LR. One and a half or two is what book's looking for. Okay. How cute these are. And then I love these. These are the root beer style. That's what I call them. Clips. I mean, it's I I really have never let these go for three dollars a pair before, but I am right now, and I can't be talked out of it because I'm so in love with vintage stuff. These these remind me of. Um, the deco, deco era. Yeah, these are kind of polished too. so much vintage stuff. Okay. I'll show you a few more and then it will send it back to Darcy. Because at, at about a quarter till I'm going to quit and give the gifts away. Love art deco. Love vintage. Can't afford any of it. Ha ha ha. <laughs> and Sharon says heart ones. Okay, Sharon. Sharon has really good taste, I can tell. You got it for $3, Sharon. I'm putting you down for another dip in the jar. We have a free freebie jar Every time you make a purchase, you get something out of it. And you are welcome, and thank you. Okay, here's some with a little stone and pearl in them. 
These are marked Japan. That's this pair. Oh, God. Look at this butterfly. It has rhinestones and pink pearls. And it looks like new condition. Those are precious. And as much as it kills me to do this, I'm going to throw these in there too. For three dollars. Look like new on the back. There's your acrylic flowers. You got a rhinestone on each end. Beautiful pair. And then last but not least, these are just as beautiful. They're pink with pink rhinestone, pink leaf, pink beads. Backs look really good. So we'll put those in the mix too. So any of those for $3, your choice. You probably won't see me do this again. And I see book is coming in at three book. You got to tell me which one you want. And Sharon wants the butterflies. Okay, Sharon, we'll see if book does not take them. Which ones was, oh yeah, aren't those precious? Oh my God, what a deal and a steal. Book, which ones did you want, honey? Honey bunny. All right, you guys can quit kissing now and tell me which ones you want. Get on with it. I ain't got all night. I got Kentucky Fried Chicken to eat. I thought it looked like you were first. No, you came in at three and then she came in at Butterflies. Exactly, Donna. Okay, pink ones. These are pink. They look like little grapes with leaves and rhinestones. And then these have pink on them. These have pink on them. Let's see. What else is pink? These have pink. The white flowers and pink ones. This one. Did this one book? Okay, I'm going to get those for you and write you down. And then Sharon was next. Sharon wanted the butterflies, but they're still available, Sharon, and I'll put you down for those. Another dip in the jar. And book gets another dip in the jar. All right. Anybody else interested in any of these? And pink bigger ones. These pink ones? The grapes?
the grapes book? Okay. Got you. Anybody else interested in any? Okay. Anybody else interested? Let me show you one more time. We've got these acrylic. Um, I call them root beer clip ons, snazzola. Those would be cute in the fall, too. And then we've got these, looks like daisies. And then the chips with pearls. And then these beautiful beaded vintage Japan. And then the, these look art deco to me. Cool. I guess that's all then. And we're going to move back to Darcy. I got to see what time it is. What time you got now? Nine twenty nine. Okay, we got fifty. And book, I got daisies. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> These are not diamonds. They are just stones. They didn't. They didn't read anything on the um, gym tester. Angie, did you get book for daisies? Yes. I okay. So again, this is a ten inch. All sterling anklet for eighteen. I didn't know if I had book in for this one or not. Let me turn. Let me turn myself. Try again. Yeah. Oh. Here we go. Go to spring ring class. So there's that one. Tammy, are you still here? Runs around seven inch. I don't know who MD is, and it's marked nine two five. It's a lobster claw. The heart hasn't been um, engraved. <clears throat> it's, a, it's a chain bracelet. Seven inch with the heart charm. This one's a yeah. This one's a half year piece. It's 
seven inch MD925. Very blurry. We're going to do this one for thirty dollars. It's a seven inch marked MD925 for $30. It's marked um, on the heart and on the clasp. Marked on the clasp and on the heart. And at any time, if you'd like to message me, email me, and would like for me to test anything, more than welcome to. Oh, I put that in the wrong thing. Hold on just one second, please. That's okay. Bookie didn't want the um the T anklet either. Okay. Book, I have to um I have to investigate test this one again. But it's right around a two, just a hair over a two. But I think ew. I think that this is um gold with um two little diamond chips and it's a little tiny it's, it's a little over a two, but I'll test this one and check it out and I'll let you know. But that's the smallest one that I have. I'm talking that thing's tiny. You must have a tiny, tiny finger, just saying. Yes, Tammy, that bracelet is heavy. Hold on, and I'll weigh it for you. About 16 grams. Now back to Angie. You're very welcome, Tammy. All right. God, I got something in my eye. I hate that. It's okay, Mama's almost done. This is a Sarah Coventry. Isn't that pretty? Acrylic, and it's got this little moon glow. Let's see if it glows. No, I don't think so. And we are going to let Sarah go for $6 tonight. She is marked, signed, sealed, and delivered. It is in perfect condition. 
looks like brand new. This would make a beautiful gift in a nice little box. These are milk glass and they're screw backs. Vintage. These are $6. They are milk glass. They are marked, but I don't have my telescope with me. I got a brand new one. I just haven't opened it yet. And Namora. <clears throat> this is a beautiful brooch. A flower, a flower, a flower, and a flower. A leaf, a leaf, and a leaf. A butterfly, or a firefly. And this has rhinestones in each flower. Pink and blue has scrolling all over the heart and it's marked also what is that I'm going to go see that one no I can't see it I can't I can't I can't too blind and this one's going to go for six dollars it's big I can tell you how si what size it is. Oh, it's a two-incher. Yes, I bought me a telescope so I could see what it says on this damn jewelry. I'm telling you. I love you too. So, so far we have some $6 items here. And this is going to be my last round. We still have time. Darcy can do a round, but then we're doing a giveaway. These are confetti vintage, but they're in new condition. Excellent condition. These would make a beautiful gift also. Pink confetti is awesome. I just love it. Those are $6. Everything in here is six dollars. You want the um, Sarah Coventry, Donna? All right, you got it. These are milk glass. They're six six dollars. This is a huge brooch. This is beautiful confetti earrings, and they're six dollars. I got I got the pin for Donna. These are pink and light pink vintage. Clip on Japan. These look like new too. They've been real good condition. Okay, and those are six dollars. These have milk glass. They're vintage. They're Japan. No, these are these are West Germany. These are also six dollars. They're milk glass. This is a wishing well um, brooch. It's really cool. The little thing moves. It's kind of a um, brass look to it. This is also six dollars. In excellent condition. Whoa. This is a Monet and it's marked right under the pen Monet. It's huge. The statement piece Monet, six dollars. And then this is like a pewter with black rhinestones in it like a flower that's just you know f floppy and it's also a pendant and that's six dollars so if anyone is interested in any of these right now let me know because we are just about to close the, the show
All right. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go back over to Darcy and see what she's got for one last round. Do it to it, girl. Not a dagnabbit thing. Oh. Dagnabbit. Dag. <sighs> All right. And Crystal, you want the win? Gotcha. This is about a 19 inch necklace that's with the extender. This is like a Brighton look alike. I just got done trying to clean it up. It needs a little bit more cleaning. We're going to do this this necklace for $4. Thank you. Thank you, Dom. Here's the back of it. Spring ring clasp. It's just a silver tone. Yes, it is. Here is a two tone. Ah! Well, I'll keep up. There went that one. I already broke it anyway. It's two, it's two necklaces, and it's, but they're put together in the circles. Not they're not hanging separately. Does that make sense? It's silver and like the gunmetal black tone. And that the gunmetal black tone is actually um, like diamond cut, so it gives it another dimension or depth to it. We're gonna do this one for five. I will measure it. It's actually a really pretty necklace. It's even got an extender. Why is this thing got an extender? It's already long enough. Whew. Sometimes I think that's so that you can double it. Oh, well, that's understandable. Here, because I always ask that question. It's got a two inch extender on it, lobster claw. about a 34 inch necklace can you show the heart close they want the edges of it and tammy what the heart is show the heart up close yeah hold on just a minute okay can you see the the cutting on these black ovals yeah Okay, there's that one. And here's the heart. Is it blurry or can you see it? Oh, I can see. Okay, there's that. And then we have this one for $5. It's three pieces hanging on these two metal things. Kind of looks like a bib necklace, but it's a longer necklace. For $5. I'll measure it.
on an 18 inch necklace. And there we go. And those are my last three inch. All right. Tell me. Let's see. Let me here. Can you tell me who all bought and how many they bought? Book bought one, two, three, four. Book bought four pieces and Tammy bought one. Okay. Is that it? Yes. Okay. I'm going to get my jar out here. All together, I have Donna bought one thing for me, so she gets something out of here. And try to mix this up the best I can. Ah. Oh. And remember, if you don't like what you got, you can trade it for something else one time. Donna, it looks like you're getting the necklace that has all the shells on it. Then one with two necklaces together. Book. Four dollar necklace with rings on it. She wants to see it. Okay. So let me show you what you got, Donna, and we'll decide if you're going to trade it or keep it. As soon as I get the dang thing untangled. It's going to be interesting. Yeah, it's pretty tangled. Um, yeah. But this is it. It's got layers of shells. It's long. Comes down with three levels here. I'm trying the best I can here, guys. So, this is what it looks like. It's really groovy. It's just tangled right now. <laughs> it's groovy. Do you want to trade it or keep it? It's brown. It's shelled. It's really beautiful when it lays right. I just don't have it laid right. Okay. Some that they want it if it's $4. Who is it? Book. Yes. Is that $4? If so, I want it, please. All right, Donna. I'm going to put this in your bag. Thank you so much for your order tonight. Yes, book. Or you won't be joining Oh, well. Book, are you talking to me? Yes or no? If so, yes, this is the one that's four dollars. Okay, I'll put her down. In. Book, you have nine things coming out of this jar tonight. So I'm just gonna close my eyes and start drawing. All right, you have these gold earrings that have like a lace around them. Let me put me up by myself so I can show them better. So you have these lacy earrings, gold tone, brand new. Thank you, Chicago lady. And then that's one. The next one you get is the shell necklace. Oh, that is cool. It's old. And 
And that's two. Next, you're getting this strawberry necklace. It's acrylic. I'm talking to you, book. You have nine gifts coming out of this thing, and I'm pulling them out right now. I have to close my eyes to, to pull stuff out of here. But these are your gifts you're getting. Everything I'm pulling out right now is yours. I just need to get shit untangled. I know it's time consuming, but it's worth it. So that's three things you have. Who is Dana? Yeah. Who is Dana? I didn't say Dana. Did I say Dana? Ah! <laughs> okay, and then you're getting these hoops. Those would be great for Halloween, actually. So that's one, two, three, four. You have five more items left. She means Darcy. Okay. All right. It looks like you're getting another necklace I pulled out here. Oh, I love this necklace. Hold on just a minute and I'll show you this one. I'll put it up here on the mannequin. There it is. <laughs> now four more. And you're not trading because you got too many. You trade that take all night. Oh, you got a scarab necklace. This is one of them that I made. So you got that necklace. Three more. Trying to close my eyes. What is this? Oh, this is a belt. Get that out of there. Good grief. Remind me not to do this again because everything tangles. So it looks like you got a chain belt. Silver tone. Cool. Two more. Close your eyes and dig, girl. Oh, you got a copper bracelet. And it's marked made in the USA. And one more. What do we got here? Ah, oh. man, things get tangled so bad. Like this, I should not have done this. Okay, so this is some kind of a glass eyeball, I guess. And it's on this really cool chain. So, all of that is yours, and I'm going to put it in your bag right now. That is my gift to you. I hope you enjoy it. There's a lot of stuff. It's like a jewelry bag, actually. I'll show you what it looks like as soon as I get it packed up. Good God. And remember, you guys, if you bring somebody that's never been here before, you get a brooch for every person you bring. And what I'll do is lay out some, and you, about 10 of them, and you can choose which one you want. Now, they can't just come and leave. But I mean, you know, come on, help out. We need to gather more people. 
Um, <sighs> can't even get all this in here. All right, so it's packed. So here's your bag. It's packed. I'm putting it with your other stuff. We got some very pretty stuff tonight too, by the way. All right, who's next? That's gonna be Crystal. Crystal gets two things out of the jar. Oops, I forgot these. Let's go with your stuff. I'm gonna get a bigger bag. You're gonna need a gallon size, girl. Oh, you're so sweet. Okay, so Crystal, Crystal, Crystal. Let's see what I can pull out. What do I got? No clue. Oh, there we go. You've got a bracelet with a little dog on it and a heart that says made with love. And you can keep it or trade it. Yes, Sharon gets three. So, Crystal, do you want to keep this or trade it? Okay. And then we're going to pull out another one. The other one is this pin. It's a flower pin by Madison. I believe it to be vintage. It came from uh, like Riches or Macy's. I forget which one, but it was marked $25 right there. You want to keep it or trade it? Keep it or trade it. All right, Crystal. You got those. Let's see. That's your two. And I thank you so much. And I hope that you get feeling better, honey. Yes, I will. I will do that, honey. Okay, next up I have Tammy. Tammy, you have three jabs at it, girl. Three dicks, Tammy. What do I got here? I got a big, fat, gaudy, brand new ring. Keep it or trade it. Are you here, Tammy? Trade it. Okay. All right. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got earrings. These are silver tone with a black acrylic for pierced ears. And that's... That's what you're keeping. You only get to trade once. Now let me see what I get for your second item. Oh, I got a purple watch. <laughs> Keep it or trade it. Oh, uh, thank you, Tammy. I mean, Crystal. You want to keep it? Okay, so we got one more. 
we got a bracelet with silver tone and little white pearls. Keep it or trade it. Give to R and R. Okay. I have to write that down. R and R watch. Got it. And do you want to keep this or trade it? I believe this is vintage. I'm going to have to fill this jar up again for next time. Next Wednesday. Yeah, I'm, I got it written down to give him the watch. But you you get a, you get a third item too. Do you want to keep this bracelet or trade it? Keep. All right. So let me put those in your box or bag or whatever you want to call it. Your locker. <laughs> <laughs> Book's going to need a locker. All right, now we're down to the last one, which is Sharon, and she gets three. Come on, Sharon, it's your turn, Miss Sharon. Tammy is a living doll. Oh, look what we drew. We drew this ring again. Keep it or, or, or trade it, Sharon. No, I didn't. I want those black earrings if Crystal doesn't. What black earrings? I don't know what black earrings you're talking about. Okay, we'll trade that. Put some more in here. All right, this is a little bear with a heart pin, and that's what you're keeping. Now we got two more turns. We got an apple. Yeah, she got Tammy got the black. This is an apple gold tone um, brooch. Keep it or trade it, Sharon. And I'll fill this thing back up before next week. Keep it? Okay. Now you got one more. Sharon, do you like to uh, untangle jewelry? Because I have one, two, three, four, five. There's about, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Here we go. There's a bunch of necklaces here, Sharon. If you like to untangle them, this can be your third one. Keep it or trade it. One of them has a little cameo on it. That one. Look how cute that is. Keep it. All right. So those are going to you, Sharon. All right, guys. Let me bring up Darcy. Sorry I had to do that, Darcy. I just, with the jar and everything, it was so much. <laughs> And so we didn't let you here so you can. Darcy's going to. She loves to give. Tammy. Ah, oh, Tammy. For the for Darcy's side. Love you guys. Every Wednesday night we're going to do it like this, and then that way I can stuff out pretty fast. Oops. 
Oh, I've never seen cha cha cha. Yeah, yeah, with the hot up, I would wear those Thanksgiving with a white sweater. Wouldn't that be cute? These are going in their little bag, and thank you very much, everybody. Well, I think for being with us. I'm not sure if your name is Darcy or uh, or Devin or Darby or I did it for a long, long time. Book I kept calling her Dar Darby or something like that. I don't remember. <laughs> it just rolls off your tongue that way. Okay, you guys, we'll see you tomorrow. Uh, the ones that can make it tomorrow at noon. And the same goes for tomorrow at noon. If you bring somebody that's never been on, you know, one of our sales before, you're going to get a free brooch. Yeah, I suck with names too, Crystal. I, I really do. I suck with remembering anything, though. <laughs> All right, and Donna, don't you work too hard tomorrow, honey. We'll be thinking about you. Love you all. Good night. Thank you.